nothing lead over the White Sox as we celebrate Lou Pinella. Dan Wilson tells a great story taking us back to the season 2001. The day we got back, we had a chance to clinch the division. And Lou was concerned because he didn't want a big celebration amidst what was going on in our country at the time. And I will never forget being called into the office as a player representative with Pat Gillick and Lou. And he said, this is what I want to do. If we clinch the thing tonight, I want to take all the players out on the, home, on, on the pitcher's mound and take a knee and say a prayer for everyone who's lost their lives and for the families of those affected by 9-11. And then I want to take a flag and walk it around the infield and stand at home plate for the fans. To me, it was one of the greatest managerial moves he ever made. It had nothing to do with baseball. Because he had compassion. And we clinched it that night. And we went out on the mound, we said a prayer. And one of the classiest things I've ever seen in baseball, we carried a flag around to a standing ovation here at Safeco Field. What a moment. And if you were there, I'm sure you'll never forget it. I'll never forget it as a player. Moving story told by Dan Wilson yesterday at the, at the uh, luncheon honoring Lou Pinella talking about September of 2000, uh, 2001.